Hey, I'm a VNI Brick, and uh, it returns a whole vloggage thing, me talking about my week in the store. Um, because we'll get with the main stuff. Yes, the games have finally begun. Bricks out is on. Uh, we are doing the bingo portion of it. Um, so different prize associated with different letters. Uh, big prizes going out uh, with X39 Brick Customs, YoHowie.com, and Lagonius, as well as myself filling up two letters with 10% off coupon in my store. Um, what else? Went over 1 million parts finally. Yeah, that was a that was a flipping labor. Let me tell you. Um, did it by myself with my own brick, with my own stuff, not financed or anything like that. Um, took a long time. I'm sure I'm gonna go back down. I probably just went back down because I just got a brick owl order that just popped up on the screen. But um, it'll happen. But I finally made it and it feels good. And I'm gonna continue to try to put a buffer in there. Um, I don't want to draw a, a part in the line or land line in the sand sort of thing for uh for parts um because i can't control that and i don't want to sort of cheapen the cheapen the whole thing my uh my deal is the selection and the amount of selection that i have in the store um right now we're third best in the u.s for new parts um and you know it keeps going up and thanks to you guys going back down um, but it's, it's way, way, way back when I can remember on one of the early Saturday streams, I was talking to, uh, Bubba and Kelly and, uh, just mentioned that, you know, they said, so what do you want to do with your store? And I had said that you know, I wanted to become like the, uh, the Amazon of Bricklink with basically if it was made, it's available and it'll be in the store. Um, it's the, uh, it's the. It's the being able to find what you're looking for. It's being able to find a lot of stuff that you're looking for. Um, and it's also about learning about stuff you didn't even know existed when you go and peruse my store. Um, it's always nice to hear back from people that uh, discovered new things because they were looking for something else in my store and happened to run across that or that face or that hair or any of that stuff. Um, it's just cool. It's cool. It's nice to be able to sort of take my passion, which is different than a lot of others, and bring it into uh, your world. So my big thing is uh, is doing the stuff with my kids. I'm not the giant creator you guys all are. Um, I'm a lot more private as far as that goes. I don't deal well with the whole judgmentalness of things. So, got my coffee still, still waiting on a new, new, new cafe cup, but, uh, I got a, I got a tea party I got to get to in a little bit here, call it a, uh, a garden party, if you will, thank you, and talk, and, um, just, it, it felt good, it was, uh, a good feeling to go over a million parts. It was a bit rushed because I wanted to get it in before uh, the Saturday stream. Or not, sorry, not Saturday stream. The uh, seller stream. Seller stream. Um, but anyways, uh, sales are doing well. You know, it, it seems as though the lull of the season, that whole summer plunge is over with. Um, it's getting cold in areas. People are building again. We're going to be doing a two-part series on how to get your bricks from your set into BrickLink and from BrickLink to Brick Owl on the next two seller streams. Um, let's see what else. I don't know. I put like 200 dimension sets into the store. I obviously got all of these. These are all reutilized uh, advent calendars. People are also wondering why I always get out band calendars. It's, it's 
for many reasons. It's not just because I like advent calendars. It's because it comes with sorting trays. Um, it's got some unique figs in there. It's got some armable figs in there, but mostly it's the parts and pieces. Um, I will be stuck with, you know, 80, 90, 100 of whatever figs were in that set for a long time, but each and every one of those sets has already been paid for um, from the parts that were in it because, ding, ding, it's all uh, gray, black, and white Star Wars shapes. Not that, you know, one shape isn't for another, but let's face it. There's certain elements that are more conducive to one thing than another. Uh, Y'all city builders don't use uh, wedge plates all that often. Um, you know. Anyways, uh, trying to think what else to go over. It's been a while since I did one of these. Um, if you want to enter in the uh, Bricks Out game, just use hashtag Bricks Out in your uh, checkout, and I will see it. Uh, don't have any deals for you this week. Um, I go in very cyclic things, and um, right now I'm concentrating more on quote-unquote back-to-basics, like increasing the number of colors available in one-to-one, -one, one by one plates, um, trying to amp up stuff more for my uh, mosaic builders and for uh, people who use a lot of the, the palette. Um, building up a bunch of CMFs. Got eight cases of CMFs coming in between series 16 and series 14 this week. Um, as well as a, a bunch, a whole bunch of older CMFs. Um, Series 2, Series 3, Series 4, trying to get more and more of the monsters in. Um, not just from Series 16, but also monsters that had been featured in previous themes and also previous CMFs. Um, I think Halloween is one of the big overlooked LEGO holidays that people really enjoy. So that's going to maybe be my thing. I don't know. Just rambling here because uh, I'm trying to fill the wants and needs of so many different sects that I enjoy both seeing and doing in the world of Lego, um, that it, sometimes it gets to be a bit much, and the whole, you, my my motto being, uh, like, invest in, buy in what you, you build, what you do, um, is good, but uh, gotta make sure we don't start doing every single theme. Because right now, uh, Big D's upstairs. Took a, just took a break from him, but he's building, uh, we're building, he's building, uh, Rex's ATTE. <clears throat> so he's pretty excited about that. Really digs it. He's doing a great job with the, all the technic framing on it. Um, you know, he's got problems putting the legs in, but, oh God, I've had problems putting those legs in there. Um, you got to make sure you have perfect aligning. But, uh, yeah, you know, it's just a good Labor Day father-son thing. Um, like I said, little A, she's got her tea party thing all going on. So I'm going to be getting off to that. But that's it for the vloggage. Um, over a million parts. The game's finally begun. Still have no idea when we're relocating. Uh, so I continue to just part out sets that are on the shelf behind me and get them into the store. Um, coming up this week, we got some city sets, some friends slash elves sets, some more of the, um, over here. I got a few more of the dimension sets to pop in and then, uh, upstairs waiting to be parted out. We've got, um, Five of the Arctic Base Camp, three of the Star Wars uh, Imperial Shuttle, three or four, I think it's four, 
of the uh, Elven Palace from a year ago. And three Friends Adventure sets. That's it. I think probably going to be done this week. But, you know, probably doing about 20 sets a week still. Larger sets. So keeping it in there. Um, got about 50 pounds worth of stuff coming into the store this week. So keep an eye out for that. For those of you who are looking for the, the more rarer stuff, that'll be coming in. But for those just looking for current pieces and particles, which are awesome too, um, that's what you see. All right, I'll try to include this little part at the end. If there's any parts of the vloggage that you liked, that you want to see again, comment down below. Let's have deep and meaningful, kind and pleasant conversations about all of this. And let me know what you think. Ask me questions here. Feel free to submit questions on this as well for any of the, for any of the uh, seller streams. And uh, I think I'm going to end up, I think I'm going to reward myself with the 1 million brick challenge um, with getting a chair and finally get rid of this uh, camping chair, get myself a real grown up big boy pant wearing chair. All right. All right. That's it. That's all. Move me a brick. Like. Give me that thumbs up. Comment. Get all chatty Cathy and such. And subscribe. Just finally commit to it. Just admit that you you watch me. It's all right. It's okay to admit to these things. There's, there's groups. There's groups. And they have meetings. And you can let them know what your name is. All right. I'm Big B.I. Brick. Thanks for joining. Hey, I'm Big B.I. Brick, and I just want to clarify that there was no intentional insult or making fun of people that go to group meetings to talk about stuff that affects them. Um, not trying to make fun of you at all. Um, I was making fun of uh, the fact that people love to hate me or something. I don't know. Anyways, I'm Big B.I. Brick. Thanks for joining. Hey, I'm Big B.I. Brick, and I just just done got insulting a whole mess of people by accident and sat here schlepping it like, what the beep did I forget? Like, blatantly in my face like, oh yeah, the name of the dang video is Mystery Package Monday, and I didn't show you our package. So... Um, there we go. We got another one of them, their big bees of sucker, Mel's purchases. So, I swore it off. Um, you guys witnessed it. I flat out said I ain't going to do it. Not going to do it anymore. And uh, I did. I uh, was contacted. I was sent a coupon for Progressive up to 35% uh, off instead of the normal 40. And I immediately was, uh-uh, not going to do it. Uh-uh, nope. Um, but then, like, three weeks later, got sent this message and I wouldn't accept this normally because it's like I don't I don't listen to the 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 princes in Nigeria when they write either um but hey uh, got car trouble need some immediate cashage um you know you can send up to 200 bones and get twice that in credit at my store so I was like, all right, with a coupon, you know, that's essentially like buying all the cool pieces for, you know, a lot of percentage off, 70-something percent off overall. 
maybe eighty percent off. Um, so I did. So I mean, just regular stuff, brown plates. I always grab these. Most useless element on Bricklink, right here. Everybody's got a million of them, and every set contains three billion. Um, but I keep grabbing them because they're part of the uh, the Sentinels, which I need to get a sponsor for. With all seriousness, um, more Sentinel pieces. Um, I seriously need to get a sponsor for more Sentinel pieces in there even. And if you've got dark pink one by two plates and you want to hook a brother up for a non-sales trade, let me know. And I'm not talking about like six of them. I'm talking about a buttload. Um, let me know because I need those. More of the most useless part, I've, I've got to take this off my wanted list. I really do. Um, red doors. Blue panels. More trans stuff, because I'm just a, a trans junkie now. And some of the light blue Baraki eyes. Brown plates. Blue one by sixes, because you can honestly never have enough one by sixes. I tell you, if there was a plate that is needs more of in the Lego world, it's one by sixes. Honestly, I have to bleeping stop buying these. Um, that is just ridiculous. Damn it. I hate it that Bricklink, if I click on like want my wanted list, if I right click on it and open into a new window, I am, uh, I'm opening up the image for it. Like, why would you even give me the ability to open the image for it? Granted, a heart with a brick wall behind it is a cool image, but, um, it's not one that I want. All right, I'm going to stop doing that right now because I was just going to go remove it from my wanted list. Anyways, gray studs, one by one bricks, one by one tiles, plates in the dark tan, hinges in the DBG, more of those said one by six, and more one by six plates, more studs, one by two plates, one by four plates, corner plates. Barrels, little ones. Green wheels, dark tan, one by one Technic, one by two brown, DBG rails, inverted slopes, barrels. Plates, tiles, bricks. Anybody watch this? One by four, blue, dark blue plate. Wheels, slopes, corner plates, panels, funkadelic, dopalicious. Razzle dazzle. These actually are pretty cool. I'm gonna talk about these. Nice. Again, junky. I think I should have opened this box from the other end. All the all the fun stuff is at the bottom. Alright, so plates. Tiles, plates, plates, cones, Technic, plates, junky, junky, hinge, plate, plate, panel, plate,
plate, plate, plate, plate, plate, hinge. Trees. Wedge plates. Wedges. DBG brick. Barrels and plates. Very basic stuff in semi uncommon colors. Or of that gray scale. God. Thank God. That's. Thank God I got enough of those. Alright. I'll be right back. Hey, I'm McBee and I'm Rick, and I'm back. I had to go to a, uh, like I said, little tea party. Alright. So, plates. Plates. Rails. More neon attic. I've always been sort of the neon color attic, but uh, I guess it's sort of out now. Yeah, here. Wedge plates. Two by two rounds. More plates. More plates. More plates. More corners. Always trying to grab those white leaves. Brown axles. More plates. Two more two two by two round. One by two by five. One by two by five. Some slopes. Just regular old stuff. Saw this in there. I thought that was pretty interesting. Some of the two by three slopes. Hinge. Hinge. Blue Greeble, sorted cones, oh, sorry to be boring, this is like 15 minutes of crap, I finally got the bag of minifigures in there, Let's try to get this quickly, painlessly as possible. This whole luggage part, I got. I'm out of it. All right. Blue studs, as you know. More crack. Black, white, two by one by two. More sentinel pieces. Technic connectors. Two by six brick. One by three plate. Inverted. It's because it's sand green. Hinge. Or them one by plates. Little these steering wheels here always seem to go. Corners. Two by six. I think those might be sentinel pieces too. More crackage. Supports. So I also, during the pausing of the video, these went on to, uh, these came off my wanted list. So, and the re I, I checked the order as well. The reason why I got these is because it was 500 of them, and they were half a cent each. So yeah, it was an amazing, not an amazing deal. It was a deal, but uh, it's still one of those why, why, why. So these new mini sink panels, let's call them. Two by two plate in red, blue one by ten, one by two DBG. I grabbed all of these uh, these hemispheres here that were in stock, and then the other crack elements. 
looking at here, just different one by one and assorted elements. Here we got the one by six plate, two by four DVG plate, two by three green plate, two by four LBG plate, two by three blue plate. A whole assorting, a smattering of plates, plates, and plates. Why? Because builders use plates. Um, that's why. Uh, tan, why? Or dark tan, why? Because to me, dark tan is a good color. I like it. More DBG color, of course. Wedge plates. 1x2x5. Um, not sure if I gotta check. These might be, I might have gotten these because they're metallic gold instead of being the pearl gold. Um, I've got a couple thousand of the pearl gold one by one plates, but I think I might have gotten some of those to, you know, increase my color count on that element, which is important. Um, people use those for detailed pictures this uh, of, of things um, this is dark blue windscreen I always try to pick up uh, windscreens that aren't clear or transparent in color uh, this is just DVG barrels and Technic plates 2x4 tile larger plates of assorted colors 2x2 two two white discs and crack elements, one by two plates, one by two black rails. These giant hero factory half mace pieces or whatever. Um, and this I don't these things will probably never sell. I've got them in a bunch of different colors. They're not popular elements. Um, I get them because I'm a like dork, um, but to me, like I, I still big part of me is the castle guy who can see people building stuff with those in castles. So very much a lot of me is is a castle guy. It's also the space guy in me. The city guy in me, but mostly the me, me enjoys sculptures, Lego sculptures, um, and stuff like that, mosaics. Here we just got a bunch of CMF, so gargoyle, gargoyle, for the Toy Story Aliens. Picked up a, a Martin Prince. And then picked up the Square Foots. Uh, square foot specifically because of uh, the pieces underneath Square Foot. Because I believe it's got a monochrome torso. And I try to put together a monochrome figs for people. So, some more. A bunch of Simpsons figs in here, um, some Cheshire heads, Cheshire tails, Cheshire torsos, Cheshire legs and other legs, uh, Homer torsos, Captain Crunch's face, arrows, rotten bananas. Grandpa torsos, crack, Mickey legs, new alien heads, crack in an orange hand. Look at the price if you want to know why. These new elements right here, not sure if you guys are familiar with these. These are already out there in a variety of colors. They're pretty cool. Um, Stormtrooper, Stormtrooper, torsos, 
Ursula torsos, unique heads, got some, some Trump hair, some police torsos, these almost look like the same shade as last time I was in Canada, um, wrestler legs, some of these uh, Nexo Knights, Ultimate guys right here. They've got uh, it's more of the flame head elements. Yeah, I've seen those. <sighs> All right, trying to dig through this quick and easy. This is going to be a forever video and. Uh, that's what happens when you guys want to see the video side. Just random glitter stuff and old arms. Random heads. These Ninjago tri saber elements. Some duck tails. Woo! Alice hair. Some of the uh, oh, some of the rally lights, the uh, the Casey lights, as so to speak. We got some heads, more heads, crack elements, more crack elements, clean minifig heads. Not sure who that is. Tops, torsos, more of those spikes in black, trans purple. What color was that? Probably shouldn't have gotten these. I think I've got a couple thousand of those. Crack elements because the tra medium blue glows. Robot arms. What are these? Maleficent. Dresses, um, ultimate somebody, but here's their Alma, Diver Dude, Diver Dudette, Indiana Jones Pilot, Fiesta Guy, Fiesta Forever. All right. Little Devil, Teen Mom, Olaf, Happy Little Dude, Ultimate Lance, Minnie's Dress, Busted Legs, Alice Dress, Simpsons Kid, uh, Random Head. These are Mr. Incredible Heads, Random Flower Elements, Ursula Base, Puppies, Heads, 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 Hair, Heads, Random Printed, Dishes, City Robber, Alien, Legs, 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 some robots from Nexto Knights, Nexo Knights, some Lifter Dude, or Nexo Knights with a Hawk, Princess, I think that's like a Emily or whatever her name is from um, the Elves line, some Star Wars Resistance Fighters, Medium Blue Doors, Batzaro, Outside Kid, Sweeper Up, Leaky Toilet, Star Wars Resistance.
carpenter gal, bunch of torsos, spooky dude, bunch of hats, classic space fan, diver dude, diver dude, Nexo Batty with a Hawk, Ultron Flyers, Scooby Doo, Alien Resistance, Ultimate Lance, this one, will, that and the, or that's Ultimate Axle, the Ultimate Lance, the Ultimate Axle, those will be personal. Crack Pieces, I uh, got Stewardess, Flight Attendant, whatever you're calling yourself now. Hair, legs, dude, Bubba, Batty, torso, torso, or them dare robots. I really like that torso right there. So I picked up that. More Bubba. Can't get enough Bubba. Trick or treater kid. Another knight. Another Batzaro. Two more spooky dudes. Working man. Another one of the I'm stuck in the land of elves, girl. Firefighter. Coasty Coasty. Hearing protection while doing work guy. Queenie, next to night baddie, two more of the aliens, I honestly think this is going to be, over time, the one that ends up getting expensive, because this is the only armyable Disney fig in the series. And then more police looking like hosties. What is that? Frickin' 35, 40 minutes for a vloggage. Um, then my, my bony part, my bonus, bonus parts. So, bonus parts go to the kids because I was getting, I found out, uh, parts that were, uh, used in there. So, alright. That's it, that's all. I'm Big B.I. Brick, and, uh, that's it for an incredibly flippin' long vloggage. Thank you all if you're up to this point. In the video, uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that crapola that I said before. Thank you very much.